अरुण खरे मेडिकल स्पेशलिस्ट consultant physician diabetologist and cardiologist today we will be talking about hypertension one of the commonest problem in the society as you know quite a large number of people they suffer with hypertension what does hypertension means we have a normal pressure in our arteries which maintains the circulation throughout the body but whenever it is above the normal level we call it hypertension hypertension is of two type systolic or diastolic the normal limit of systolic blood pressure is 100 to 140 and diastolic 60 to 90 any pressure above this limit is treated as hypertension the commonest cause causes of the hypertension are unhealthy living uh, lifestyle strong family history in the for the uh, of the hypertension unhealthy diet smoking alcohol consumption lack of exercise one of the very important factor lack of exercise age factor with the growing is the arteries they get uh, less elastic and the bp rises and low potassium diet is also one of the factor which causes hypertension and one of the most important factor is stress stress is a very well known factor for the hypertension common symptoms of hypertension are headache irritability giddiness vomiting and tiredness many a times patient do not have any symptom in spite of having high blood pressure that's why sometimes we call it a silent killer as well if patient's bp continuously remains very high he can develop lot of complications like cerebral hemorrhage cardiac problems renal failure retinal hemorrhage even leading to the blindness so it is very important to diagnose and prevent and treat the hypertension the only way to diagnose hypertension is to measure the hyper, uh, blood pressure using a sphygmomanometer we can any physician can diagnose whether patient is hypertension or not normally when heart pumps the blood pressure the upper limit we call it systolic hypertension when heart relaxes so pressure comes down in the arteries and that lower limit is called the diastolic blood pressure hypertension can be systolic it is above 140 with the normal diastolic blood pressure it can be diastolic hypertension with a normal systolic but diastolic remains 100 or above so this, that is called diastolic hypertension prevention the prevention of the hypertension is very important one should do regular exercises healthy food especially avoiding lot of salt in the diet especially the food products processed food products in which the salt is used as a preservative should be avoided like pickles papad and so many other food products which contain lot of sodium in the as a preservative then weight control obesity is known uh, risk factor for the hypertension so one should try and control the weight avoid smoking tobacco chewing alcohol consumption regular check up is very important so that whenever your blood pressure goes above the normal limit so you can consult your physician and take guidance if necessary treatment it is not necessary a 
very common myth with the patients are that doctor do i have to continue the treatment lifelong now once i am diagnosed with hypertension no that's not true if your blood pressure is under control with the diet control regular exercise then one can stop medication but that needs regular checkup so that if blood pressure goes above the normal limit and doesn't come down with the lifestyle measurements then medication is important in the diet avoid saturated fats salt take high potassium diet preferably dash or mediterranean diet that is lot of cereals with the fiber unpolished especially lot of fruits vegetables salads and reduce saturated fatty acids saturated fatty acids they increase the cholesterol as they increase the blood pressure and risk for the cardiac problems as well so this is the time we have to be aware of hypertension it can be prevented it can be treated and one can live a long healthy life with regular prevention and management thank you